What exactly did you find the other night? <laughs> I don't even know what it is. What do you mean you don't know? What I mean is, I don't know if it's human or not. What is that supposed to mean? Can you shush? <gasps> Come, quick. <laughs> Do you see that? Oh my god. What is that? Ow! You stepped on my foot! Uh, sorry! Don't scare us like that. Where did it go? What? Huh? Great, now we've lost it. If it wasn't for you stepping on my foot, we would have kept an eye on that thing. And if we weren't here in the first place, we wouldn't possibly be thinking that I might be behind us right now. Uh, good morning, sir. Here's the paper. Thank you. Just leave it on the desk. Was there any obvious evidence? No. Witnesses? <sighs> Was there anything? We found this. It belongs to Olivia Graham. One of the children that went missing last night. We also found footprints of the three children. And when we got to the end of their tracks, we arrived to this open area and that was where the footprints stopped appearing. What do you mean by that? Like, on the spot? They didn't go anywhere else? Yes. We also found tracks of an unidentifiable. Continue. It appears to be from the paws of a feline, but it doesn't match any of our prints of the town residents. And another thing, its tracks seem to fade away. Well, of course. The wind can blow away its tracks and- No, will. Not only the residue of the footprint is gone, but also the DNA. We will have to discuss this later. I'm going to set a meeting with the victim's parents. We will need all the information we can get. Thank you, Brayden. Uh, were you invited to the mayor's annual party tomorrow evening? Yes. Will you be going? Or is this case too important to put aside for a night? I will go. <laughs> Thank you so much. I'll see you tomorrow. Thank you. Good night.
Molly, what has gotten into you? The desire for sweet revenge. I will end your life like how you ended mine. Molly, trying to have an affair with Mr. Owen with such a low family status won't get you anywhere. Either way, them finding out now or later will lead you on the streets again. I was trying to help you. Help me? Help me? You ruined me, Penny. I thought we were friends. We are friends. You knew that marrying Mr. Owen would have practically saved me. But, oh, Lord, you decided to take all the good chances for yourself. First, you report that my parents stole their wealth. Now, you tell them that I am a witch and I tried to kill Mr. Owen. You're selfish, Penny. You took everything away from me. But I let you stay with my family when your parents were killed for their punishment. I thought that if I told Mr. Owen about your dark secrets, it would teach you a lesson that you're not guided through most of your life. All the good things won't come to you easily. You have to work for it. Maybe I should have left you there, starving on the streets that night when your parents died. Perhaps that would have given you some sense. You wish you'd never said that.